So this is something I've been excited to try out. It is a two-sided hot pot, electric hot pot. So you can make your own hot pot at home, which I love to do, but it's actually really easy to do. And the great part about this, check this out. You can make two broths split exactly in the middle. So you can have a spicy side and a different flavored one if you want. It comes with this plug-in gauge here where you can choose either a rolling boil or maybe you just want it simmering really lightly. That way you can choose how quick your food is being cooked. So first thing we have to do is get this thing plugged in. Now I had to use an extension cord because as you can see the cord you get is not very long. And after that, you can plug your gauge just right into the back end of your hot pot. And I'm just going to set the gauge to five to start just to get this thing up and boiling. Now inside, I have three cups of water on both sides and I just put in a bunch of minced garlic, but I am going to cheat a little bit with a hot pot kit. Now this kit is for six cups of water total, so I'm going to split it between the two sides and it comes with a bunch of different add-ons. Now to utilize the two sides, I'm going to take some peppers here and I'm just going to put some Thai red peppers on the other side just to spice it up a little bit. Let's add one more. Now we wait for it to get up to a boil. You can also give it a little mix just to get that powder and all that stuff together. I can't find my chopsticks, so we're using a fork today. I have a bunch of different sides here. We have sliced beef, sliced pork, dumplings, green onions, broccoli, and potatoes. Also some vermicelli noodles. These are great to just throw in and they cook super quick. And then just a hot pot sauce. This is vinegar, soy sauce, Thai peppers, green onions, and garlic, lots of garlic. Okay, we're about lukewarm now. Oh, that is good broth. Okay, it is just about at a rolling boil. Let's give this a little taste. Mm -hmm. That is nice and hot now. So let's throw in some broccoli. We got some potatoes. Those take a while to cook. And let's try a piece of pork. Definitely suggest chopsticks, that's for sure. Nice cooked piece of pork right here. Look at that. Grab our sauce, put in our sauce. Oh yeah. Give that a try. Mmm. Try a piece of beef. What doneness do you guys go to at Hot Pot for beef? I like it just a little bit red. Give that a try. Mm. Definitely a really good combo device. I love that you're gonna be able to do both a spicy side and a nice kind of chill side. And this is perfect for probably up to four people. That way you can have multiple people over and do it as a little dinner idea as well. If you just wanna have it for yourself, go ahead. This might last more than one meal though. Uh, and I do suggest using both sides so the other one isn't just there with nothing in it. Or just put some empty water if you're just using one. But overall, this is a really great dual hot pot.